You may soon get to vote on abortion rights in Missouri. The campaign pushing to overturn Missouri's abortion ban says it turned in more than 380,000 signatures from every county in Missouri today. Missouri Capitol Bureau reporter Joe McLean is in Jefferson City explaining what's next for this controversial issue. Abortion rights are under attack. What do we do? Stand up, my back. On Friday, the campaign Missourians for Constitutional Freedom delivered dozens of boxes to the Secretary of State's office. Despite every obstacle put in our way by the opposition, we made it. For the question to go on the statewide ballot, the campaign has to have raised at least 172,000 signatures. Abortion rights advocates say they collected more than twice that amount. If signatures are certified, voters would be asked whether they want the Missouri Constitution to protect the right to abortion up until the point of viability, the same standard imposed by Roe versus Wade. The amendment would also contain a ban on any discrimination against someone because they underwent an abortion. Abortion is health care. Abortion is normal, yeah. and those who have had and will have abortions deserve dignity and respect. Yeah. Just days earlier, on the other side of the Capitol, opponents of abortion rights from across the Midwest convened for a rally. The biggest motivating factor, they tell me, is the abortion rights initiative. It would be a mistake to think that there's any state in the country where we can just rest easy and assume that pro-life laws will stay in place undefended, even in Missouri. And so it's important to make sure that we're well connected to each other. From here, the Secretary of State's office will send all those signatures out to the local election authorities to be certified. And those are due to be returned by July 30th. That means this question is more than likely going to appear on your November ballot. In Jefferson City, Joe McLean, First Alert 4.